us how to live in beautiful places like this in Portugal and work remotely. It's something called, something called the digital nomad visa. Now, they don't have a digital nomad visa there. If you're not familiar with that, it basically is a trend that's becoming very popular where people are traveling around the world and they're living in other places for short to longer extended periods of time while working in their home country. This is a two-part video. One, I'm going to talk about Portugal and how you can live there. And two, I'm going to talk about how you can start up a remote business or income if you don't have one. So let's talk about Portugal first. So Portugal, um, you can live there up to 90 days if you live in the US or Canada with right away, you don't need a visa. And of course, if you're part of the European Union, then you can obviously live there really easily. And if you're not sure, if you're in any other country, um, you could just double check with a website that I'm gonna leave in the comments, but it's called atlys.com, atlas.com. There's a little app you can use to apply. Now, if you want to stay more than 90 days, you can actually apply for something called a, um, let me find the word here. It is not a digital visa. They don't actually have a nomad digital visa, but they have something called the D7 visa, which is very similar. And you apply for that and it'll let you stay for up to a year and work remotely. Now, if you don't have a um, income where you can work online, or if you don't have something like a business that creates income, then that's what I can help you with. That's what I do. Um, I actually started up a, a business with affiliate marketing and affiliate marketing is my number one way to work remotely because it creates a predictable income and I love it and I can count on it month after month after month.